Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. We're full on batteries now. <laughs> Alright, let's hear from Peach as usual when we turn on the game. Dear Mario, I am here to sell you five one-ups. I know, it's the most amazing deal you've ever seen. All you have to do is give me 500 star bits for them and they're all yours. I'll give you the one-ups. First, but then you know you gotta give me those star bits. Just just send them back. It's not a pyramid scheme or anything like that. <laughs> okay, so yeah, there's the. I I don't think we should probably follow that. In fact, I I I think I kind of question if that's actually Princess Peach. But anyway, another branch, Honey Hop Galaxy. Look at the little thumbnail there. It's the return of the bees. The sweetest silver stars. And we will be collecting them. Oh god. <laughs> I hope it's not on her body like before. And oh that was that was something. <laughs> Thank you for the welcome there. Text box. Well not a box, text blurb. Welcome to our sleepy lunge! The queen rules our land! Red and blue clothes. Hmm, not very bee like if you ask me. But you've got you've got blue on. What if I was green and blue? Like if I was Ouija, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe it's just the red that throws them off. So how high can I fly? Ah, we can probably I said we could probably get up here. <laughs> there we go. Look at that, it's magical. So yeah, there's, there's a new little element over there, as you can see, via those honeycombs. You can also kind of flop on over there and coins if you have sticky honeycomb. Yum! Oh <laughs> yes! As a bee, you can climb on the honeycombs, but going off the edges of them, you'll automatically go into your floaty, flyy procedure type thing. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah! No big deal. <laughs> Anything over? I don't think so. Nah, I just wanted to see. What is actually. Ah, oh, it's a wall. It's a wall, dang it. Just never know when there's an invisible wall in your way until you've touched it. I assure you, there's one there. Hmm, <laughs> water to take me out of my bee form. Shouldn't be that big of a deal. Just take a look, see around here. Hello there, Piper. Let's see what's in this. Ooh, a bonus. Ooh, a bonus. Let's try and knock them all into the same corner so I don't have to walk around nearly as much. <laughs> one star bits, two star bits, and I guess a one up. That's it. All right, there's our bonus area for the day. Oh, jeez. Oh, did he, he just poop me right on the water? I wasn't even given the chance to fly and keep my my beeness. How could you? How could you? Well, you did, and I guess that's all that matters. <laughs> yeah, okay, I think this, this branch here is pretty well cleaned out in terms of the showcasing, so... I think we're gonna start our trek going up here now. Nope. Nope. Mm, yes, we will, I mean, but I mean, nope to the piranha plant. Oh shoot, why did I. I knew that water was coming, but I just. I don't know. <laughs> How about I do it like this? So just. There we go. <laughs> That'll do just fine. <laughs> and to the honeycombs. Eh. Actually, I can probably just, yeah, instead of going under him or something like that. Oh wait, that's not good, that's a bubble. That'll turn me away from my bee form once more. Okay, we're good. This is, we're playing Donkey Kong, aren't we? <laughs> oh no! Well, I guess it doesn't matter as we have the power of bee right here, but... Oh, no, 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 okay. <laughs> go, 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 okay, we're safe. You're safe from the water. But not from the Kakas. Oh, we're back to 3D-ish. Although we were kind of in 3D before. Uh, anyway. <laughs> it's the floaty fluff. Shake the... the we are about to float with it. Pressing A makes it disappear, though. So be careful. Woo, floaty fluff. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. You only have as much fluff 
to do this, like, you know, to make yourself fluff up. Three. Oh, shoot, that was not... Yeah, just that one time. I think that was a little bit too early, but... Eh, we're okay, I guess. <laughs> we're, we're still... still kicking. And now we're into Silver Star territory, I do believe, so... Get out your... binoculars, I guess, to take a look around. <laughs> I think I'm gonna, uh, gonna get out of my B form here. It's, it's kind of not really allowing me to go super fast around places. <laughs> you know, this at the B, not really the most mobile of creatures aside aside from a brief flight. But you know, that brief flight is pretty important in spots. Mm, all new B recruits must report to the queen immediately. All right, going to the queen. But okay, first silver stars. By the way, there is a... I was, I was trying to show on the camera, yeah. There's a mushroom directly above the middle of this. <laughs> so I got away from it so I could show you its relative position, but then it kind of went off. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, no, no, not, not, not yet, not yet. We've got this. Yes. Whoop! All right. <laughs> Did you see the silver stars from from the sky? It was beautiful! I did not see them because I just entered this place. Oops. Well, well, as I said, I'm not too concerned about being a bee when it's going to be slower anyway. Like, I can't do my long jumps, my backflips, and stuff like that. It's just, just a tragedy, I know. <laughs> hmm, let's see here. Can I reach this with a bee? Yes, I can. If not, I was just gonna jump down to it from above there, so not really a big deal or anything like that. Uh, the other place that was led to was right there by that flower over there. So yeah, not really, not really a big deal if you take either path. You're still gonna end up at the same air general area anyway. And you're gonna want to explore everything for silver stars too. So yeah. Keep that in mind. Don't get hit by those. Well, I guess you can get hit by those, but I was gonna say if you if you do get hit by them, you're gonna lose your B and probably fall down below. And uh oh, you have someone asleep on the job. Well, there are actually they're following me at the moment. <laughs> Uh, let's take a look see over here. Oh, there's a silver star. What was I lied to? What what the heck? What the heck? And wait, wait hold on. I wanna show you. Yeah, this is actually I, th I thought I was actually gonna lead down to doom, but but I, <laughs> I Guess it leads just back over to this side down here and that, that lily pad has got a quite the sharp edge there. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I guess this is- oh, this is on the other side of that flower over there, okay. So I was thinking that was further more south on this particular area, but I was not. But anyway. Ooh, Comet Metal! Yeah! <laughs> Just don't die, I'm gonna have to recollect that. <laughs> I don't think there's really all that much to die to on this particular one, though. Okay, I think I got everything cleared out nicely down there. Coolness! Oh, it's a pleasure to meet a new bee! I have a favorite to ask! This is a terror- I mean, there's a terribly itchy spot on my back- Oh no! <laughs> Would you please, please be so kind as to take a look at it? <laughs> oh no! Why me? Whoops. <laughs> well, I suppose I could always wash off in the water after I finish. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll, we'll I, I, no! I'm feeling it coming up. I'm in, uh, oh, jeez. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh! I see what it is. <sighs> At least I think that. Ugh. That's what it is. Okay. I'm, just, I'm gonna try not to imagine too many things here. I'm just gonna get get off the, the planet. She's got her own gravity. Yes, yes. You gotta get off. Uh, whoops! I wanna get. <laughs> I oh no. uh, yeah. You gotta get off her somehow. Uh, no, I want to get. Oh, there we go. Well, whatever. <laughs> it's kind of hard to get off of her for some reason, but yeah, she's got her own gravitational field like Peter Griffin does. And there is our star. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I 
But there be another star to collect here, my fellow pirates. I don't know why I did an even pirate song there, but I don't know, just, just came to mind. We're in the engine room, though. Woo! Alrighty, and now we're gonna, we're finally gonna add this to the uh, collection. <laughs> Oh, there's something to do there now, to look at that. Ooh, sequel to Flipsville. <laughs> What's that? A striped mushroom. Never seen one of those before. Yeah, even though we were already dealing with the bee mushroom before in another level, they finally added it to here. <laughs> just just starting from this level, World 4, yeah. You, uh, yeah, have fun with your unusual toy there. I ain't judging. Thank you, I will. I'm out of here. <laughs> yeah, I think I can just like... Yeah, mm, well, uh, I said I can... Uh, I say I can, Why am I not able to wall kick off that... Okay, like a wall kick there, was the vines causing me ire or something? This should not be. <laughs> and he teleported up here somehow. Don't know how he did it, but he did it. Hmm. Oh, actually, actually, come to think of it, I think I will actually go over to here because I think there's only two here, and the other one is a comet. So I guess I'm going over the Flipsville. <laughs> That's okay with me. Woo! And it is the purple coin spin speed run that all those words together just does not sound good. Oh no! <laughs> this area! Oh yes, this area. So we gotta get them all before the time runs out. All 100 of those suckers. Flip gravity, flip gravity! Uh, well, well, okay. <laughs> so I get the higher ones first here. Oh! No, you don't. Uh, so now I can't, like, do my usual. Well, I <laughs> got it that way. Because <laughs> you, you get a little boost if you're spinneroo if you do it that way. <laughs> so, yeah, it's, it's, there's a lot of time to get them, but it's still. Still gonna be probably dicey because of this whole gravity mechanic, but as long as you focus on the coins, you should be okay. Maybe. <laughs> Who knows? Yeah, okay, I'll do that. And I'll do the flipperoo. And I'm gonna wait until it flips one more time, otherwise, I'm gonna end up in the same area as I was before. Uh, I'm gonna go. This way first, I think. Because if I do that, I'm able to eh, take care of this dead end right away. Uh, I don't know about. Mm, eh. mm. Hold on a sec. <laughs> okay, there we go. <laughs> See that little a little boost makes a, such a big difference. Oh come on. <laughs> We're almost there! I'm trying to do this as cleverly as I possibly can. <laughs> and I'm gonna go like... oh... Wait, hold on. Yeah, the boost! <laughs> okay, one more. One more roll. Uh, uh, yeah, I could do wall kicks, but it's just the thing of, like, I can't, like... And I don't want to leave and go into the area. I was gonna say, I don't want to leave a room accidentally by doing a wall kick and then a spin drill if I can help it, because I might end up in a room that I can't quite easily get back from. <laughs> that's that's pretty bad, especially when you're in a in speedrun situation. All right, let's call this a level. <laughs> that went relatively smooth. Wahoo, indeed. But, will we get another comet somewhere else? Maybe, maybe. Mm -hmm. I'm waiting. Galaxy complete! No comets. Okay, then I guess we're going over. Um, hmm, that one could be long. I. Uh, <laughs> mm hmm, hmm. Just trying to think of how to best fill out 
I'll, I'll call the Luma, I guess. Because I think this is a one-star galaxy aside from a comet, if I recall correctly. So I think I'm, I think I'm going to finally give this one a feeding 1,200 star bits on top of the many, 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 many you need for the final star. <laughs> That's bit, well, the music is so high-pitched now, because there's so many. <laughs> and now... It has been unlocked! A dead-end galaxy! Which is important to 100%ing! Go! <laughs> this is... The Sweet Mystery Galaxy! As you can see, there's a bald berry there. So that, that's where the mystery comes into place, so hello, Yoshi! Ballberry's Mysterious Glow. Hello, Invisible Platforms and Yoshi. Well, actually, they're, I, don't, I don't even want to call them Invisible Platforms. They don't even exist unless you've got the Ballberry ingested. Ooh, yes. Star Bits. <laughs> so it's, it's a food-themed planet of all sorts of sweet desserts. As you can tell in the background, mmm, <laughs> delicious. Everything is edible. Mmm, cookies. So many cookies. Already a midpoint. That was, that's an awfully generous midpoint. <laughs> Obviously, there is this over here. Which, uh, actually, hold on a sec. <laughs> yeah, I semi know the layout of these cookies. I just want to show you around the, all the platforms here. Okay, we're running low on our Bulby power. Yeah, okay. <laughs> now let's continue normally. Uh, wait, wait, actually, not that normally. Uh, there's this over here for the Comet Metal. Yes, oh, uh-oh, uh -oh. this is not looking good. Oh! Oh, why didn't a Yoshi jump there? Yeah, I should have definitely Yoshi jumped there. Oh, that's why they hate. That's why they give you the midpoint. <laughs> All right, it's gonna go around this way again, just because it's the fastest way around, I think. And it's time to be a little bit more efficient with our ball berry power. <laughs> Don't know how I could have messed it up that badly, but there we go. Comet medal collected. And let's see here. Just looking for paths around all over the place just for kicks. Oh, with that. Yeah, that happens if you take a. <laughs> if you take a hit. <laughs> oh, poopers. So you did not indeed get that comet medal. We've got to recollect that comet medal. <laughs> That's okay. We've got this in the bag. We've had two other times to practice for it. <laughs> but yeah, but seriously, that that midpoint there is pretty pointless for the most part. <laughs> offy offy. Um hmm. In fact that that midpoint even kind of prevents me from collecting star bits, in a way, if you think about it. Because <laughs> the first area that has the, by the way, you can see like the the type of bar that is actually inside these wrappers. I think that's a pretty neat detail. But yeah, <laughs> the, the thing about it is that I could go back, I suppose, for said star bits at the beginning. Like, remember at the beginning of the galaxy, I automatically pointed in the background around here to collect the star bits over there. Not really all that convenient to do so with the midpoint. So it's like the midpoint there is more of an inconvenience than anything. Yeah. I'm gonna go upsie doodle, I suppose. Yes. I'm gonna grab all the star bits that I can, as long as I'm up in the air. Uh, and waiting for my platform to be better timed, I suppose. Mm, actually, the platform's moving pretty fast, so it's not really that big of a deal. Mm, get you! I just, I just let them suck on my face, and then we have a good time for, for like a minute or so, and then I, I just knock them right off. <laughs> Yeah, that's... I wanna, yeah, this is obviously a, a switch-pressing area, so... Try and think efficiently, obviously. We're just gonna go around the edges first, and then kind of go to the middle, as it's mainly a square-type formation. And there we go. In fact, it is a square-type formation. 
It, it is most certainly a perfect square, actually. <laughs> Yeehaw! Oh, man! <laughs> We're not done yet, though. We've lost our gift. It is gone to the netherworld. Except for, you know, the leaking kind of... Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, I got a midpoint, I'm happy. <laughs> Except for the fact that, well, you can kind of make it reappear with the power of the bulb. So, what this seems to be able to do is bring back a place that was gone at one other time, I, I suppose. <laughs> Need to get... Oh, shoot, that's not good. Oh, that's very bad. <laughs> I accidentally just walked myself off the edge thinking that there is a a little extra platform there, but there wasn't. Well, why did I do that? I'm not I'm not in Yoshi form. <laughs> not in Yoshi form to point and lick. <laughs> there you go, and look at that. We got the star. <laughs> we eventually got the star. <laughs> I don't think that should have taken me as long as it did, but it happens sometimes. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> and 59! Let's see if anything else happens uh, after this here. Well, besides, you know, connecting the paths, I suppose, but that's not really what I meant by see what happens. I thought maybe like another comet or something. Oh! Oh, there is actually something. What's it? Oh, oh, oh. I, I want to talk, not jump. A button is both talk and jump. That place is rough, but you still pulled through like a champ. You know, if you had a player two to assist you a bit, I might it might be a little easier and more fun. Yeah, maybe. Maybe. But you're gonna miss out on the challenge. <laughs> and with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when I explore new galaxies.